Okay, so I got the, uh, I was trying to get the keyboard to, um, you know, keyboard input here on the computer um, to register an output, you know, just some sort of, to communicate with the, uh, with the Arduino. Um, I actually had to do kind of a workaround. So what I have here is essentially all my pins here. This is an Arduino sketch. Um, so there's all my pins. Um, there's my serial. Actually, I'm not using that, but I basically just initialize all these as outputs here. Um, and then I come in here and I say, okay, if the serial's available, um, I read the serial. I'm not sure actually even why this is happening, but I, I, those are required. Otherwise, it just checks that available. Um, but then if there is serial, if there's data coming in from the, from the serial port, then I tell it to do a random blink, and there it is, just a, a high and low random. Um, I, pick a, I pick a random light and just blink it. So that's the Arduino. Um, so I come up here, I upload it. So now that is running on the Arduino. Um, uh, done uploading, okay. So then I had to come over into this process and sketch here and this was kind of this hacky workaround thing I found on the forums, um, because the key, the key pressed method, is in processing, but it's not in the Arduino library. Which I'm again, I couldn't even find documentation for that, but uh, th this way works. So, um, so in this processing uh, sketch, I do processing. I, I import the uh, the serial packages, um, all the classes in there. I create a serial port here. Um, I just create just a, whatever there, just a stage. Um, but I'm actually not even really doing anything with that. Um, set up the serial here. Um, I'm pulling it off the list, off uh, it's the second one in the list. Um, the draw method is empty. And then basically in here, I'm saying, in the key pressed, I'm just basically saying, write something, anything. So this, as this writes, now I'm going to run this. So I just clicked run, and this popped up here. So now here's my little sketch, right? And if you see, I'm going to focus on the little transmitting data. Now as I type, can you see the little orange lights blinking, transmitting and receiving data? And uh, so basically those are, those are indicators that this processing sketch is writing to the port, to the serial port. And as we know, the, as I just showed you, the, the Arduino's, you know, the, the currently running sketch on the Arduino is, uh, is reading the serial. So that's what those two lights are blinking. And then sure enough, so as I type on here, we see that these lights are going crazy. I'm hitting just the space bar right here. That's the space bar, and it's just going crazy. So um, it's random. So that's pretty good. So uh, I solved that problem, but it was it was yeah, a little tricky. And at this point, this this uh, key capture program has to be active, um, as you see. And I'm typing here, but if I focus on on another program um, and type, you see nothing happens, right? Um, so that's bad. I, I want to just have this always capturing the keyboard in input, so that, that's my next plan. Anyway, that's it for now.